Hey Fahaita. It's been a while since we caught up. How have you been? Hi Shamima. I know, it feels like ages. I've been good, busy with work and life, you know. I totally get that. Work can be so demanding. Anything exciting happening on that front? Well, I did get a promotion last month. I'm now a senior project manager. It's been a lot more responsibility, but I'm excited about the challenge. Wow, congratulations, Fahaita. That's amazing news. You've always been so dedicated to your job, and it's paying off. Thanks, Shamima. It means a lot. How about you? How's everything on your end? Things have been good. I've been taking some online courses to expand my skills, and I recently started a small side business making homemade candles. It's been fun and a nice creative outlet. That sounds awesome. I've always admired your creativity. What made you decide to start a candle making business? Well, I've always loved candles, and during the pandemic, I started making them as a hobby. People started showing interest, so I thought, why not turn it into a small business? That's fantastic. I'll have to check out your candles sometime. Do you have a website or a social media page? Yeah, I set up an Instagram page for it. It's called Shine Bright Candles. I'd love for you to follow it and give me your thoughts. Absolutely, I'll follow right away. I'm sure they're amazing. So, any other exciting news in your life? Well, I've been thinking about taking a vacation soon. I could use a break, you know. Maybe a beach getaway or something. Any recommendations? Oh, that sounds perfect. How about a trip to Bali? It's beautiful, with stunning beaches and a rich culture to explore. I went a couple of years ago, and I still dream about it. Bali sounds like a dream. I'll look into it. Thanks for the suggestion, Fahaita. You're welcome. If you decide to go, I can give you some tips and recommendations. That would be fantastic. You're the best, Fahaita. Likewise, Shamima. Let's not wait so long to catch up next time. We should plan a get-together soon. Absolutely, let's do that. It was great talking to you today. You too, Shamima. Take care and talk to you soon. Hey Sarai, how's it going? It's been a while since we caught up. Hey Rakish, I know, it feels like forever. I've been good, busy with work and life. How about you? Same here, man. Work's been hectic, but you know how it is. Any exciting updates on your end? Well, I finally finished that online course on digital marketing I told you about. It was tough, but I learned a lot. Thinking about using those skills for a side hustle. That's awesome, Sirai. You're always so motivated. What kind of side hustle are you thinking of? I'm thinking of starting a small online marketing consultancy. I've already helped a few friends with their social media and website stuff, so I figured why not turn it into a business, right? That's a great idea. Your expertise in digital marketing could really help local businesses thrive. Do you have a name for your consultancy yet? I'm brainstorming some ideas, but nothing concrete yet. Got any suggestions? How about Digital Boost Solutions? It conveys the idea of helping businesses boost their online presence. I like that, Rakish. It's catchy and to the point. Thanks for the suggestion. No problem, happy to help. So, apart from work, what else have you been up to? Well, I've been trying to stay active. Started going to the gym regularly, and I even signed up for a 10k charity run next month. It's a challenge, but I'm excited. That's impressive, Sirai. I've been trying to get back into shape too, but it's been tough with the long work hours. Maybe you can motivate me to hit the gym more often. Absolutely, we can be gym buddies. It's easier to stick to a routine when you have someone to keep you accountable. Sounds like a plan, my friend. Let's do it. By the way, have you been keeping up with any new movies or TV shows? Yeah, I watched that new series on streaming, The Last Frontier. It's got a great storyline and some amazing cinematography. Nice, I've heard good things about it. I'll have to check it out. Thanks for the recommendation. Anytime, Rakish. So, what's new with you? Any exciting plans coming up? Not much planned at the moment, but I'm thinking of taking a short vacation soon, just to unwind. 
Maybe we could plan a trip together sometime? That sounds fantastic. Let's definitely plan something. It would be great to explore a new place together. Agreed, Sarai. Well, it's been great catching up with you. Let's make sure we don't wait too long before our next chat. Absolutely, Rakish. Take care, and let's stay in touch. You too, Sarai. Have a fantastic day. Hey Jaren, how's everything going at work? Hey Nabil, not too bad. Actually, I wanted to talk to you about something. I've been thinking about asking for a salary increment. Oh, really? That's interesting. What's prompting you to do that? Well, I've been with the company for over two years now, and I've taken on more responsibilities and completed some significant projects. Plus, I've seen a few colleagues get raises recently. I think it's time I brought up the topic. I totally understand where you're coming from. It's important to be fairly compensated for your efforts and the value you bring to the company. Have you done any research on how to approach this conversation? Yeah, I've been reading about it. It seems like I should start by scheduling a meeting with my manager to discuss my performance and contributions. That's a good first step. When you meet with your manager, make sure to be prepared with data and examples of your accomplishments. Show them how your work has positively impacted the team and the company's bottom line. That's solid advice, Nabil. I've already started compiling a list of my achievements and any positive feedback or testimonials from colleagues and clients. Great, that will definitely strengthen your case. Also, be ready to talk about market research regarding salary ranges for your position in your industry and location. It will help you justify your request. True, I've been looking into that too. I want to make sure I ask for a reasonable increase, not something outlandish. Absolutely, being reasonable and well prepared will work in your favor. Remember to approach the conversation calmly and professionally, focusing on the value you bring to the company rather than making it personal. Thanks for the advice, Nabil. It's a bit nerve wracking, but I believe it's the right step for my career. I'm sure you'll do great. Jaren. Just stay confident and remember your worth. If you ever want to practice the conversation or need more tips, feel free to reach out. Thanks, Nabil. I appreciate your support and guidance. Let's hope for the best. <laughs>